Hello, good morning everybody. I've decided to film another all in or recovery video today and I am feeling quite hungry so I'm gonna go downstairs and have breakfast now. I wanted to mention something that I don't think I've heard anyone talk about before and it is the tendency to go to the toilet before a meal when you have an eating disorder. And the reason we do this is because we want every meal to be perfect because you've made it into this big thing, this big deal because it doesn't happen often. So I'm going to start to get out of that habit because obviously I am eating enough and mealtimes do not have to be perfect to be delicious. So I'm going to try and not go to the toilet before meals today. And I know that might be a bit TMI, but I feel like it's important to share this because it is an eating disorder tendency that people do and don't talk about. So I thought I'd talk about it. And so let's challenge it today. <laughs> Also, another thing, I've been finding it really difficult not to calculate my calories. And even though I'm having like 3,000 or over in calories, I am still calculating it and all it's doing is making me feel bad. So I'm going to try and have foods that I don't know the calories of. For example, granola. I can't weigh it out or weigh out my milk, so I don't know the calories in it, and that's why I've been having that recently. And so I'm gonna try and implement that throughout the day, just have things I don't know the calories of, I can't weigh, I can't measure out, and things like that. Anyway, sorry about the ramble. I'm gonna now go down and make breakfast. Okay, so it's granola time, I'm gonna pour as much as I want into the bowl. There we go. And I'm gonna pour in some oat milk. That's the way I like it. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else noticed, but I forgot to make myself a caramel latte this morning. I just forgot about it. And I think it shows that I'm becoming less food focused. Like I would have never forgotten the caramel latte before because it would be such an important part of my breakfast. Like it would fill me up. But now because I'm eating whatever I want, I'm not worried about filling myself up and therefore I forgot to make it. Obviously I'm still gonna make it after this <laughs> because I love them and I just, I, I just like drinking them. But I thought it was a nice little progressive moment Anyway, I'm gonna enjoy my breakfast now. Like, I crave this in the morning, something crunchy. I'm definitely more of a sweet breakfast person. Whoever invented granola, oats, I guess that's the universe. I love you. You are amazing and you do great things. As always, I'm going to finish my breakfast off camera, but Everything will be eaten, I can assure you, and I'll see you after breakfast. I have finished my breakfast, it was delicious, and I am full, but I'm going to have my caramel latte because I just like to have them with my breakfast, so let's go and get that. I'm so sorry, I forgot you, but I got you now. Caramel latte, let's go make it. And my caramel latte has been made, so I'm going to now drink this whilst watching some YouTube. Alrighty, so I've now finished my caramel latte and I've come into the kitchen to make myself some lunch for later because me and Henry are meeting each other this morning but I'll have to go straight to work so I'm going to need lunch in between. Uh... That's my chicken. Well, fake chicken. But yes, as I was saying, I will be going straight to work so I'll need lunch and I can't afford to buy food out every day. So I'm making it now in advance. We didn't have any vegetarian sandwich filler like corn ham or anything. So I've had to cook something and let's just say I haven't done a very good job because it's meant to be crispy but it's not meant to be this crispy. I'll show you. <laughs> uh. This is um, my crispy chicken fillet. <laughs> oh my goodness. It'll still be delicious though, and that's the main thing. So I'm gonna make a wrap and then put this inside. So that 
is my wrap made for lunch. So I'm gonna put it in some foil now and bring it with me. So, for a snack today, me and Henry went and just got, I like to call them pinkety sprinkety donuts. Pinkety sprinkety. Yeah, but they're sugar strand donuts. So we're gonna have one each. Are you excited for a donut? Yes, actually. I'm really happy. Do you wanna, do you wanna have one? Should I open that? Yeah. I'll do the grand unveiling. <laughs> yeah, you can open them. Mmm. I'm gonna eat one of my donuts now, and look how cute they are. Well, one of them's Henry's and one of them's mine. But look how cute. I'm not gonna eat yours, don't worry. Thank you. He's driving. Wow. He's terrified I'm gonna eat it before we get I'm to our destination. <laughs> okay, it's donut time. It's lunch time, so I'm gonna eat my chicken wrap that I made earlier, but it's not actual chicken. It's probably gonna be really messy because I can't roll stuff into wrap. a wrap very wrap stuff. Very. Oh, no. Seasoning. My first hair of the day. Hopefully it's not in the actual wrap. Yeah. So this is a bit funky looking. Yeah, you you're correct about you're wrapping still. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I pulled the whole pickle out. Apple <laughs> 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 gobble. <laughs> this is really burnt. I burnt the chicken. <sighs> if we had wraps, I'd make a curry wrap. Mm. With rice. Is your mum made curry? Yeah, it's so good. Mm. It's the best one she's made. Dash of lemon juice, a sprinkle of sugar, mother. And a spoon of love. Can I? Can I? I'm having Diet Coke. Oh, this is going to be the first Oh, that's, yeah. That, look at that. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I know you want some. All right. I actually did a, whoa. It tastes like it did the first time I drank it, like ever. I brought some party rings to have with my lunch and a cheese string, but to be honest, I'm pretty full. Where's my cheese string, Henry? Have you eaten my cheese string? Definitely oh not. Oh my gosh. He doesn't like cheese strings. I hate cheese strings. They're so good. <gasps> I found it. Okay. <laughs> I keep drinking your drink. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. a bit squashed. Where's the party rings gone? I guess I find one, I lose the other. What is your tongue? Up there in your head. <gasps> Not one to do that. You're going to be in work for the next. <laughs> wow. That was a massive thing. That's so rageful. I'm having some cheese string. Ew. <laughs> It's, it's nice, but it's melted. That's Looks good. more sweaty than melted. <laughs> sweaty cheese chip. I forgot how much I like these. I'm having a party ring. We're good, but I'm bored. Lunch is done. I finished. I'm full. <laughs> <laughs> now you've got to eat it. <laughs> Get off, I'm not anymore. Okay, so that's lunch done. And I will see you at dinner later. I am actually so full. I'll see you at dinner. Sadly, Henry won't be there. Unless. No. Henry won't be there. <laughs> but I'll see you then. Thank you. It's dinner time. Work, so it is dinner time and I have a cannelloni for dinner tonight so I'm really excited it's just in the microwave dancing around now and then I will show you what it looks like look at that this is the most perfect dinner ever oh my gosh I'm so excited to eat this
I thought I'd mention that I did have the urge to go to the toilet before eating and filming this clip but I decided to ignore the urge and I'm going to challenge it because this can't be something I do for the rest of my life even though it's not a big deal or anything it doesn't really change my life that drastically I should be able to eat a meal and feel good about it even if I haven't been to the toilet beforehand <laughs> Really silly, I know, but it's just something we do. We want everything to feel right when we have an eating disorder. So let's get rid of that. Mm -mm. I have now finished my cannelloni and I've just been sat down editing a video. And I thought I would make myself a little dessert of some golden syrup porridge. Just because I really love it. It just tastes amazing and it is sweet. That's just what I'm craving, so I thought I'd have that. I'm not hungry, but I have been wanting porridge before bed recently. I thought I'd just have it now, because I'm probably going to end up having it later. So let's go make myself a dessert of some golden syrup porridge. Yum, yum, yum. I have now got my golden syrup porridge for supper. I am super satiated and it's safe to say that I will be full for the rest of the night now. I'm going to end the video here so I hope you enjoyed seeing what I ate today. If you did please remember to give the video a like and subscribe, maybe even comment. I'm pretty sure I will be filming tomorrow so I will see you very very soon. Thank you for watching, goodbye!